Hey again. In my last video, if you watched it, I said that I was going to make a second video because not only did I get the mineral makeup at the Indie Garage Sale, I also got these really awesome soaps from Dirty Ass Soaps, who also has an Etsy. Now, the main appeal to her shop is that she makes a lot of soaps that look like food. Like, like food you can actually eat. Like stacks of Oreos, these awesome sushi sets that they just look so cute. And Rice Krispies, these cupcakes that like are like, you know, actual like cupcake size. Like it's not like the, the stinky thing. But they and they smell good too. I haven't gotten around to using the map because I like to finish whatever soap I'm using right now. So the shower gel that I'm using right now it still has a little bit, but once I use that, I'm going to switch to one of these bars. I just wanted to talk about how awesome they are now while everything's still fresh in my mind. <laughs> so First of all, I don't know if she does it like this on her Etsy, but her sign at the craft fair was, if you buy four soaps this size, and this is the back, then you can get, they're usually six each. The bigger set's like a sushi set or maybe 15, and then there's this huge lunch bag set that she has that's really cool. It has like apple, sandwich, stuff like that. It's like 35, but it's huge. It's a huge set. So these were, so normally six, but four for 20. So I did that. This one is Mountain Dew scented. And it really, it really does smell like Mountain Dew. I'm more of a Code Red girl, but Mountain Dew still smells good. So this one, I took the label off because it's a present for my boyfriend's mom. I didn't know if the name Dirty Ass Soaps would offend her. So I took it off just in case. And another cool, so she puts like, how much it is, four ounces, and then the name of it, and then this is for dirty skin. She also has some for oily skin, I think I have an oily skin one, a, um, itchy skin or dull skin, stuff like that, and she had it all nice and rose. And, uh, so, this one, Mountain Dew. I also have another Mountain Dew one for myself, but this one's for my boyfriend's mom, so I'll show you one that, uh, has a label on the back. See, it has, uh, it's 100% vegan soap. I don't know if that would make you more likely to buy something. I'm not exactly sure what would go into soap normally to make it not vegan. So I'm not really in the know about soaps. But this is 100% vegan. Dirty Ass Soaps. Their website is on the back. But if you go to their website and you click on one of the items, like you want to see like how to order it, it'll just take you to their Etsy anyway. So I'm just going to provide the Etsy link in the sidebar. Um, this is for the, the oily skin. This is lavender tea tree. There was another lavender soap, because I got this for my mom for Christmas because she loves lavender stuff. There was another lavender, but this caught, like, the corner of my eye. I looked at it, and this smelled more to me, so I got this instead. And then, two I got for myself. This is uh, black tea for dull skin. Sometimes skin gets dull during the winter. So I got this. It smells really good, like tea, duh. Again, there's a label. And all of these are nicely wrapped like this. And she wrapped them up really nicely, too, for me to take home. Because uh, I'll show you one, the other, the special one that I bought that is $10. But she wrapped them up so carefully. And, like, there's special details on the $10 one I bought. And she wrapped it up, and she said she was wrapping it up, like, doubly. Because, so that the, bu the buttons on it didn't get mashed or, like, you know, smushed off on my way home. So I thought that was really nice of her. She, again, she was a sweetheart. Everyone that I talked to and met at the Indie Garage Sale sweethearts love them they're so nice so creative you know this is sea moss it's for dry skin i don't know if you can use these on your face i'm just gonna do body but i am a sucker for anything like <clears throat> sea scented sea moss um like, uh, lush has uh, like the the lots of sea type things the sea scrubs Love it. I just love the scent of the ocean, sea, stuff like that. So this is sea moss. Smells, again, like the sea. I love it. This is probably going to be the one I use first. Now the one that I'm going to show you now, I don't know if I'll actually use it. Because <laughs> it's just so awesome. This, I don't know if anyone that will be watching makeup videos will play video games. Maybe you do. I don't know. But I do. I'm a big gamer. So she also has other gamer items. I'll show you this one. It's a classic Nintendo controller. And do you see what I mean about, like, these buttons are actually, like, out. I don't know if you can see it. Like, they're up. They're special, made. And there's even, like, a little, 
and do you see the indentation there? That's like where the cord would go. And it, it's just really cool. It's individually packaged. She has a bunch of these. I think she also sells like a two pack on her Etsy. These ones smell like Mountain Dew, which I think is cool because what do gamers usually drink? Mountain Dew. They even have gamer fuel. So smells good, but I don't know if I'll use it because it's awesome. But she does have other ones. Like up, she didn't have it there, but on her Etsy site she has a like maybe this big of Space Invaders. Like it's like a block with the little Space Invader guys coming down. And then there is some Tetris blocks and she also has puzzle ones. So there are sets that she does sell, such as the puzzles. There's this cheese and crackers that she sells. You get a bunch of crackers and then a little thing of cheese. It's just it's really interesting and cool, and I don't know, people that can make, like, makeup, so it really fascinates me. Like, I'd like to get into that someday, but I know I just don't have the time between classes and everything and doing these videos, but I might end up using this, because, again, I can always order more, but it's just so cool, like, how much time would go into making something like this with the individual controllers and stuff, and she had a lot of other scents, too. And I know what she does. I think it's a cupcake. Like, you get two cupcakes on the site. Stuff like that. Prices vary from soap to soap. I know these ones are, like, six, and they're all the same size. But, like, for stuff like this, like, like the Tetris blocks and stuff, prices vary because, again, different different colors go in, different smells go in. Not sure what, like, the Tetris blocks would smell like. But she, when I was investigating this, because I instantly, like, honed, zeroed in on it, she, and I was picking it up, and she said, that's, I, fl I made that smell like Mountain Dew. And I was like, that's awesome. I'm, I'm just really enjoying it. And I can't wait to use them. My shower gel is almost out, so maybe I'll do an updated video, maybe in a couple weeks after I've had some time to use them. Maybe even later on, once I've used maybe three of them, you know, that way you can really get a feel. But in case you want to check it out, maybe order some for yourself, I'll have the link in whichever way the sidebar is. I don't know, don't care. But, again, Dirty Ass Soaps, 100% vegan, cool designs, very nice lady. So, go check it out if you, you want to see some interesting soaps. Thanks!